about to show you the ultimate three screen gaming and productivity setup. All of the other reviews for this Mobile Pixels Trio Max setup are sponsored and outdated, not this video. This is an honest and unbiased review as I bought this with my own money. I'm gonna show you all of the main features and some that no one else is talking about for some reason. The unboxing, setup process, and my overall top pros and cons. This was the highest reviewed portable laptop monitor setup that I could find, so I had to check it out myself. FYI, you can get just one of these if you want just one additional monitor, but I wanted the full three screen experience, so I bought two. Now let's check out the unboxing. Trio Max for anywhere work takes you. You can opt for a dual screen to the left or right of your laptop monitor or clip two trios together for a triple viewing experience. The possibilities are endless. You can see in the box it comes with a power cable, magnets, and a clip for two monitors. So we've got a setup guide. You can scan this QR code with your phone or just visit this link for the installation process. Here at the top, you can see the instruction for laptops that are under 16 inches. And then for laptops with monitors that are above 16 inches, first you're gonna have to decide which side you want the screen to extend from on the left or the right, and then align the edge of the template to the edge of your laptop. And make sure not to go past this red zone or else the screen itself is gonna be sticking outside of the back of your screen, even when it's closed up. You're gonna wanna stay out of this red zone if you want the screen to be completely consistent sealed when you're not using it. And then again, line up the magnets and remove the template. And then here's that template. Do not use the template if the monitor is brand new out of the box. Follow the yellow card for setup instructions. And then here's the actual monitor. I know it's plastic, but it's got a very nice brushed black metal looking design. Very sleek. And you can tell that this logo is probably going to illuminate when we connect everything and turn it on. It looks pretty good. But before we set that up, let's go ahead and see what else is in the box. We've got your USB-C cable with a pretty cool adapter to USB-A if you don't have USB-C. And then we've got our connector clip for those of you like us that are going to be using three screens. And then we've got an instruction manual with extra adhesives. Your alcohol pad for cleaning the back of your laptop lid first. Those extra adhesives. Oh, cool. Enjoy 20% off on all accessories at mobilepixels.us. Code HAPPY20. That's pretty cool. And then here's your extensive user guide. This side shows you your driver installation guide for Windows and Mac. If you have USB-C, it should work automatically. Your attachment guide again, and then all of your different modes. And then on the back, some more information for Windows and Mac and how to fine tune the settings for your monitors. And then lastly, our super powerful magnets. All right, let's go ahead and pop these out and get it all set up. These magnets are super super powerful. Okay, so this is my second time putting the magnets on. I don't actually recommend using this guide right here because when I first did that, it said to put it close to the edge, but I didn't know how much extra room that I needed, which resulted in this hanging off the side right here versus being completely flush. So what I think I'm going to do instead is go ahead and put these magnets on these metal plates at the farthest position right here, and then remove the stickers on the back so that I can place this thing manually the exact way that I want it. So I'm going to go ahead and put that there. flip it over, make sure that this looks good from the back. So what I noticed on mine the first time that I did this, my hinge was actually running into the back of this screen. So the higher up that you can put it on your monitor, the better. Go ahead and take these stickers off. Make sure everything's at the farthest position. Right about there. Press it down. And then go ahead and open it up. Then go ahead and slide it out. You can see that after it's extended all the way, that's when the entire thing starts to slide on those magnets that gives it more room for the hinge. Pretty cool. And since I made sure to put it at the top of my monitor lid, there's plenty of room at the bottom for the laptop hinge. Then all we need to do is plug this end into our USB-C port on our computer and then the other side into our monitor. Yeah, that was ridiculously easy. And then attach it to the back of this first one with that clip. All right, in the grand reveal, you can see there's about an inch left on that side. So they claim that you can do three monitors with only a 17 inch screen. Unfortunately, that's not really the case. You know what, I'm not gonna lie, a 17 inch laptop is too big of a screen for the three screen setup. This is as far out as it can extend and you can see on this side, there's about a half an inch of real estate on this screen that you can't even see. I love the double screen format, but the triple screen, so I don't actually recommend you getting two of them for three screen mode unless you have a 16 inch laptop or lower. Now for the more detailed specs, they have 
a standard HD resolution of 1920 by 1080 p at 60 hertz with 300 nits brightness. The Trio Max that we got is the largest one weighing in at about 2 pounds with a 14.1 inch display and it's made for laptops with up to a 17.3 inch display but as you can see here only if you're going to be using it with two screens and extend it all the way. And they have options for smaller laptop screens and we'll get to that here in a sec. Now as far as compatibility goes these screens work with both Windows and Mac, Nintendo Switches and Android phones. I also tested it on my Chromebook and it worked on that as well. 99% of people buying these screens will probably be using it just for their laptops though. Now depending on your needs, there's four main modes that you can transform these monitors into. Just two screen or three screen side by side mode. If you have just one extra screen, one cool feature that a lot of other reviews have not mentioned is the auto rotation feature called the G sensor. This lets you on the fly flip your screen from one side of the computer to the other and then automatically flips your display for you. That's pretty cool. Presentation mode which lets you rotate your screen 180 degrees to easily share your screen with everyone else. By the way, these monitors are actually capable of up to 270 degrees of rotation. That's insane. Detached completely in portrait mode for vertical viewing. And as a bonus for those with three screens, this cool triangulated conference mode. As far as the settings on the monitors, you've got three main buttons. The top and the bottom control your brightness settings on the fly. And the button in the middle is your menu button where you can fine tune to your liking things like contrast, and saturation, your color temperature modes, eye care mode for reducing eye strain at night, and your G sensor toggle. Turning this off would mean your screen would be locked and not automatically flip when you rotate your screen to the other side. Now, if you're someone that doesn't like permanent magnets on the back of your laptop screen, you can use this as a standalone monitor and purchase their magnetic stand for $35 to just place the screen separately next to your laptop. By the way, these prices are subject to change based on demand and availability. So check out my links in the comments and description below for the most up-to-date pricing. But as of this recording, one of these by itself will cost you $300 unless you go with the smaller option for a smaller 13 to 14 inch laptops. That one will cost you about $260. Obviously for two of the larger versions to mimic our setup will total to about $600. But if you use my code that's next to my link in the description, you can get an additional 15% off. So don't forget to copy that before you click on my link. And if you're kind of rough with your things, this is made out of plastic. So you may get a little bit more peace of mind by selecting up to a three-year protection as well. One option if you're just not so sure about this is the try before you buy option. That actually lets you test it out for 30 days before it charges you. You do need to put a $30 deposit down though and there is a $15 restocking fee if you change your mind and send it back. So my top pros and cons. My first one is that there's no vertical tilt. I really wish there was a way to tilt the screen forward or backwards. So whatever way your laptop screen is tilted, that's the angle that your screens are going to be locked to. My number two disappointment is that the three screen mode is just not wide enough for 17 inch monitors. Having any part of my screen covered up is just kind of annoying. My number three con is that there's no premium options. I do wish there was a higher res option for a 1440p screen or for gamers a screen with a faster refresh rate than 60 hertz. 60 hertz will cap your frames per second to 60 fps no matter how fast your computer is. Now my top pros for the Trio Max. Number one is ease of use. I was pretty impressed right off the bat how simple this whole process was. And for those of you who have USB-C ports, it's gonna just work immediately after plugging it in. And number two is versatility. The magnetic design of this is just genius. And it makes it incredibly easy and quick to transform into any of those modes on the fly, almost instantly. And number three is compatibility. Aside from not being able to work with an iPhone, being able to use this with a Mac or PC, Chromebooks, or even a Nintendo Switch makes the market for this product huge. I don't know anyone with a portable setup that wouldn't benefit from at least one of these. Overall, it's safe to say that this has been my favorite laptop accessory that I've ever had. I'm constantly working back and forth between rooms depending on whether I need to watch the kids or just spend some time around my wife while I'm working. And having at least one additional mobile monitor wherever I go has led to an incredible increase in productivity. Mobile Pixels also has another product called the Mobile Pixels Duo that's thinner and lighter and has thinner bezels, but it doesn't have a three screen mode capability. And I'll include links to that one as well. I personally prefer the Mobile Pixels Trio Max for the sole fact that you can upgrade to three screens later if you want to. I have a feeling that many of you who experience one of these are going to want another one on the other side to help increase your productivity even further. And if you do decide to purchase one, I would really appreciate it if you use my affiliate links in the comments and description below as I get a small commission and no cost to you for every single purchase made.
good. And it's a major factor in keeping this channel going and getting better and better for you. Or if you just want to support this channel and help keep it growing, please consider becoming a channel member by clicking on the join button below. I'd also like to thank all of my members for their monthly support of this channel. I really appreciate you guys. Every little bit helps. And remember every week I do a giveaway that randomly selects someone who's interacted with this channel in some way or filled out the form in the description. So make sure to like, comment, and subscribe with notifications turned on to stay up to date with that as well as staying up to date with all of my latest gaming PCs. And the winner for this week is... Fire King. Thanks for watching guys. I love you guys. God bless.